Yeah, headbutt. Yeah. I gotta hurry. There's some bad stuff right here. Oh, hurry up. Hurry oh, up. I got hurry it. Up. I got it, Froggy. Oh, run. Run. The Mega Rock thing's coming. Oh, man. Wow. There we go. Wow. It is beautiful, Froggy. Omega oh, Rock Drake. Omega oh, Rock Drake. Hey guys, it's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Ball. That's right, we're playing Dino Overhaul Axe, and man, are we having some fun! My goodness! Uh, yeah, pretty excited today. Last episode, at the very end of the episode, we teamed up with Froggy Man, this amazing new Apex Cardo. Look at this guy! He's super duper cool looking. Totally loving him. Um, we also got a really good, let's, I guess I can toss it out. Really good Apex Pteranodon. Finally, level 871. Very beautiful. And actually, in between episodes, while I was doing my thumbnail, I also went ahead and tamed up a second one because we did lose one of our guys. Our first Apex Pteranodon. We lost last episode. My goodness. Let's go ahead, bring him out. Yep. That's him. Look at him. Beautiful. So another real pretty one. Mid-level. So yeah, very cool. Anyway, uh, today we're going to be hoofing it solo for a little bit. Um, Froggy Man, he may join up with us in a bit. Let's get these guys all cryoed up. Oh my goodness. But uh, we need to really get some major improvements. We got to get teleporters going on in the base so we can get out in and out safely. This wyvern, it's still harassing us. It has been harassing us for days and it is so brutal. Like, look at this. Just even standing here in the base. Nest protector warning. Yeah. Um, Things could get pretty rough, especially solo, but we'll do our best. But we have to get teleporters to do that. We got to be able to get a fabricator. We got to be able to get hopefully power and stuff set up. Um, So, yeah, we need oil. That's what it all boils down to. So let's uh, let's head out here. There's some real badness out here. Uh, um, There's this crazy Dodic dude down here. Uh, we, we really got to kind of get far away. I don't know where he is right now. Let's put this on. All right, it looks like he's kind of gone. So that's at least good. Um, Do I see a wyvern coming after me? I don't think so. I don't know. It is so rough. I'm so scared to death, and we could lose all of our dinos at any second. Anyway, let's grab this Apex Trained on. I'm going to take the lower level one out. Yeah, because I don't want to lose our higher level one. Once we're somewhere safe. We can actually, you know, go in and do more shenanigans. But anyway, um, let's head on out. I think we're going to head over to like the Crystal Isles area. I always call it that. I know it's not called that. But, you know, the uh, the area that we tame these pteranodons in, it is just you don't see as much badness there. You know, as much like big, nasty creatures. Ugh, and it's all foggy out today. I hate that. How it has all the graphical glitches and whatnot. Anyway, um, yeah, let's get out of here. It looks like we actually made it safely, luckily. Um, and let's see if we can get, I don't know, maybe Trilobites would be our best bet. Oh, look at that Spino. Normal Spino. Okay, and then we can actually level up our Tranid on and whatnot. All right, I'm feeling good about today. I am feeling good. Oh, this nasty fog. Um, possible that if I use the... Uh, Mr. Fister's fog remover will get rid of that. We have one set up already, but the server just restarted. There was a mod update. Yes, in the uh, reusable mod. They added in the only th main thing that I noticed was they added in a reusable an unbreakable miner's helmet, which is pretty cool. We can't quite afford that yet, though. What do we got? Mega piranhas. All right. So anyway, uh, I guess it's kind of safe here. Maybe. What is that? Another Apex Carno. All right. Um, actually, I think this is the way we want to be flying. So let me make my way over to the safe area and I'll see you guys right back. All right. It looks like we made it to the safe area, or at least what I consider the safe area. All right. Very cool. I wouldn't mind getting now that I'm thinking about it. I'm seeing a lot of trikes here. I wouldn't. That's an apex trike. What does that take to tame? Can I passive tame that? Uh, KO tame, simple kibble. It actually probably wouldn't be too hard. But, um, yeah, that looks like something we might be interested in. Uh, oh man, there's so many dillos around here. Alright, come on. 
Come on. Oh, my goodness. We don't have any levels in this trained on yet, so it's kind of rough. Come on. I don't even think I have food in this guy now I think about it. All right, um, let's get out our car now. Yeah, I think we can cause some real havoc over here. Let's go ahead, scoop you first. All right, very cool. Let's grab your inventories. Beautiful. Oh, crap. There's like a pack of dillos right there. All right, hurry up, get the carno out. Get the carno out. Boom. Awesome. Let's get the pickup thing on him, get some meats in him. Beautiful, and oh my goodness, how evil is that? 666 right off the bat, that's crazy town. That's what his attack attacks for. I guess it's kind of suiting for Cardo. Um, Let's also get a, uh, a little hack in here. Boom, so we can make the fog remover. All right, and fog. All right, I think I can just have it out. I don't even have to do a setting. I think I can just set it down right that, maybe? Is it not working now? Make him happy? Ah, oh, there's fog anyway. All right, anyway, let's pick this up. I'm going to carry it with me. All right, beautiful. Didn't really do very much. Um, Let's start to wreck some face, guys. Wow. This is a huge upgrade, like five hundred some odd right off the bat. That's craziness. And we got a lot of levels, too. I had this guy sitting out for a while. So let's, uh, I guess, get them all into attack. I don't think many of the other stats really do much, but we have 44,224 4, health. Very reasonable health for compared to anything so far. I also upgraded the saddle with the upgrade station, 27 armor. I know it sounds like nothing, but that is a lot compared to uh, what a base saddle is. Wow, 2,000 now. All right, we're in business, guys. I mean, we definitely, we can only handle so much, but that is not a bad start. Let's go ahead and see. That was an Apex. So many awesome goodies in Apex. I do have to say. Nice. And we're going to be leveling like crazy. So anyway, uh, main goal while we're over here, in addition to leveling... What is that rage meter on the car now mean? Does that do more damage? Or is that is that part of this? Hold on, hold on. I'm really curious now. Whoa! Dude, is that a... That, I feel like that might be a charge meter. That's craziness. That is super awesome. And it actually runs faster. I love it. I totally love it. I was not expecting this. This isn't a vanilla thing, right? I don't recall that. Anyway, neither here nor there. Um, let's see. We've got that guy, Apex Strike. That might be kind of interesting to try and tame. Let's get boosted up a little bit. I mean, I don't know. Would a high-level vanilla be better than a low-level Apex? And I can't shoot off this guy, right? No stinking way. I can shoot off of him? All right. That is pretty game-changing. That means we can actually shoot things and not be exposed. That is awesome. All right. Um, I have the kibble for this guy. It's it's just the regular kibble, right? Simple kibble. Yeah. I we can definitely do that. Let's uh let's check this out. Come here, bro. Um, boom. Come on, it doesn't do as much probably if I hit him in, in the head like that. Uh, come on, come on, don't do not do this. I'm actually high enough up that I might be able to hit over his head, maybe. All right, Torpor rising, we're doing fine. He's not really doing much. Did he dismount me? No, he didn't dismount us. Come on, bro. Did I, I hit myself, oh my goodness. All right, let's turn. Come on. All right, beautiful. The Torpor's rising. That's probably enough to get him out. I'll get him one more time. Oh, crap, I missed. I don't know how that missed, but I missed. Crap, crap, crap. Come on, come on. Reload. All right, that's better. All right, there we go. That should be enough to get him out. One would assume. All right, down, down for the count. 
All right, one simple kibble. Um, oh crap, I didn't check there's Dillos. Come on. And we got him, our first Apex Trike. And I can only assume this guy will be able to harvest metal and everything like the vanilla one. You know, the, the vanilla version of a trike in this mod, because, you know, everything's modded in this. That is super cool. Our first tame of the day. Not bad. Oh, my goodness. I love 6,000 now. This is craziness. Absolute craziness. Anyway, I don't want to get too distracted. We have to, have to, have to get oil. And I really don't think we can make it into the, uh, you know, the, the winter type biomes or or uh, over by Eldridge, which has oil nodes. Um, we don't have Scooby yet, so we can't really go underwater. So, yeah. Dude, that Bronto, I bet you that would give mad levels. Seriously mad levels. All right, let's run through here. Is that a normal Bronto? Kind of curious. I don't have Froggy Man here to warn me about things, though. You know, if something could go wrong. Dude, one bite gave me bone break? Are you serious? Get out of here, bro. Yeah, because, like, I don't know if there's other changes in the mod, you know, compared to what it normally is. If, like, a Bronto could hit through the mount or something crazy. Who knows? Uh, I think we, unless this guy resists, one hit should get him. And boom! That was epic! Oh, I love it so much. All right. Ooh, a 720 trike. That's pretty interesting too. I um I can I'm going to passive tame this guy. Come here, bro. Let's get kibble, let's get the green. Let's not forget it's in that slot like I did the other day. Beautiful. All right, now we actually have a good vanilla trike too. That's an awesome looking one. All right, pick you up in the cryo, and let's get this swaps back out. Um, what I have in there before? Berries? I think I put berries there. I don't know. Anyway, it doesn't matter. All right, carrying on. We are doing epically awesome, getting so many levels. Very cool. Still got a long way to go, but, you know, is what it is. All right, and we got Megalodon. Why not? Let's get some Megalodon teeth. Come here, Megalodon. Correct. You know, there hypothetically could be trilobites in here. If you're if I'm getting, you know, these type of creatures spawn in there. Alright, anyway, focusing back. We gotta get trilobites. Also, if we see any more good apex pteranodons, we just gotta tame like every one. Because we lose these things so incredibly quickly. It's not even funny. Oh, do you know what just occurred to me? I should get one of those whale dudes, one of those basiliosaurs. That would probably give me all the oil I would need. Like, totally. All right, I'm going to keep my eyes open. I'm going to level up a bit, and uh, I'll see you guys back in a few. We got a lot that we want to do today. Cool, angelfish. All right, guys, I think I found something Finally, no trilobites, not a single one. That has been annoying me, but right underneath here, check it out. We've got not one, but two of these basiosaurs. So I'm hoping, oh man, I'm hoping that with the Cardo, we can get up and close and maybe, maybe get a whole ton of oil. That would make my day. All right, come on. Don't go too deep, bro. Don't go too deep. Holy crap, we got to be able to do this. Come on, please give me tons of oil. Oh, dude, come on, come on. Yes. Oh, 3,000 oil. That is way more than enough. Jeez, these guys are mean. Dude, chill out. Chill the crap out. Oh, my goodness. Oh, <laughs> all right. Very cool. Um, there is one more of those guys. I, I got to get like some of my stamina and stuff back. Also, positive news. Froggy Man just logged on. So we should, after this, probably go meet up with him. All right. Come on. Come on. Before my oxygen's gone, bro. Oh, crap. Let's go back up. My oxygen is almost gone. All right. Oxygen back. 
Just get right above this guy's head. He's coming up closer to the surface. All right, here we go. Yes. Oh my goodness. So good. So incredibly good. All right, we got to get, 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 dude. No, no, no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Holy crap. Uh, go, 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 go. It's like blocking me. I'm getting slow. All right. Oh my goodness. That was awesome. That was totally awesome. All right. We got a sharky shark. Come here, sharky shark. Nice. Oh, I am loving it. All right, so uh, I think we did pretty good. Why don't, I'm trying to think there's anything else. I'm gonna grab up, I need to get some like flint and that sort of shenanigans. Let's grab some of that stuff and I will meet you back at the base. All right, guys, doing awesome. I'm about ready to die and go back to the base. Um, but I wanna grab these beaver dams and there's a level 900 beaver right here. What would it take? It says it's passive tame, one superior kibble. So, I mean, that actually looks kind of cool. Why don't we see if we can snag this guy? Come here, bro. Yes! That was the 900, right? Yes, it was. Yeah, it's crazy. I don't get why there's lower taming levels in this. Like, that should have been a perfect tame, but whatever. 89 plus 89 levels. Anyway, um, very cool. Beaver. Let's go ahead and scoop you. All right, got him. What's this one? 480. All right. Um, right, I'm probably going to let the beaver get me. Let's just go ahead, grab all the shenanigans out. Come on, beavers, come get me. Oh, you see him? There's somebody beelining towards me. All right, there's another beaver dam. Quick, quick, get it, get it before he kills me. And nice. Tons of cementing paste. Dude, look at the beavers. All right, let's keep on running. Who knows? I might find another beaver dam. Any more? Oh, I'm not seeing any more. That's a shame. All right. Uh, yeah, my weight's pretty high. Come here, beavers. Come get me. Yeah. All right. You're pretty looking one. Look at you. They're so mean. Dude, we got three of them. Oh, look at you. It's got a pretty tail. All right, we almost done. Let's go. Let's go. Finish me off, guys. Thank you very much. All right. Awesome. All right, guys, we are back at the base. My goodness, what an awesome day so far. And Froggy Man's just waiting for us. So let's try and hurry. Um, we want to make a fabricator. We're going to make the S plus variant. Sweet. Um, let's get in our forge. Boom, boom, boom. Some oil cooking up. So we got gasoline. Beautiful. All right, we'll let that continue to cook. We got to find a place for the fabricator, which is kind of big. Kind of, kind of big. Where can we put this guy? I guess I'll put him for just right now, right here. We're going to move it. That's kind of not a great spot. But I think that's good enough. All right. So there. Let's now grab. We want to make electronics. So let's go ahead. We should have silica pearls up the wazoo. Beautiful. Let's grab out uh, some metal. Boom, boom. Beautiful. Get it all tossed in here. Boom, 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 boom. Turned on. Oh, no, not electrical. Where the crap is it? Composites. And boom. Look at all them electronics now. That is epic. Teleporters. Awesome. All right. So we need to get two remotes. That's for dang sure. One for me, one for Froggy. Ooh, good thing I had the... Oh, crap. Do I just realized? No, it takes polymer. Crap nuggets. All right, let's pop off real quick. Come on, get the obsidian. Yes, we are in business. All right, coming back in on the base. Let's toss this obsidian in there. And where's it at? Boom. I think so. All right, awesome. So let's go ahead now and pull for a teleporter. Boom and boom. Awesome. And two teleporters. Not bad. So we'll set one up here at the base and then we'll set one out somewhere safe. And I think we should be golden. 
Anyway, let's meet up in a call with the Froggy Man. Froggy! How you doing today, buddy bro? Oh man, amazing as always. Nice. Dude, check out what I got for us. Oh dude, teleporters, man. That is going to make life nice. Yep, I got something else. Oh, what you got? Let's see if you can catch it. Oh, didn't catch it, but I got it. Nice. It. Oh dude, that's super awesome, man. Yeah, that dude. Handy. So, um, we can just teleport right out of here to an obby. All right, man, let's go for it. I don't know how much safer an obby is going to be. I don't know. Do our base, this is like the worst spot I've seen right at our base. Um, what do you want to go for, though? Uh, I was thinking, man, it would be a good time. Maybe I can get a car now today. Dude, that, that would be perfect. Good. Can we breathe them? Uh, yeah. yeah oh, okay. Yeah, we're getting a car now. We are oh, getting dude. a car now. All right. I don't know which obby's which, though. <laughs> So just okay, I think it's the first one. We'll find out. What's right. the worst that could happen, you know? Yo, what's the worst that could happen? Well, see, hey. look at that. Perfect. I don't know what's around um, here, though. You, oh, um, there's, ooh, oh, what Apex cool. Griffin Prime Wild. Yeah, that's what's around here. That thing's cool looking, though. Right. Is that something so, we can tame someday? Uh, well, no, so we got to kill it. And then we can, uh, get and then you a, get a tame. An ancient, an ancient ah. griffin. Yeah. Okay. I'm you digging can get it. An ancient griffin and an ancient griffin prime. Sweet. All right. Um, it's pretty safe if you want to hop on your pteranodon. Okay. And let's start hunting for Carnos. That sounds like a plan. Oh, look at that color. Froggy. You're never going to believe it. Look at this guy. I know, man. What's he eating on? We are so lucky. It's just right here. Is this an apex? Oh, no. It is an apex. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's green too. Dude, this is the one. Okay, this is the one. All right, uh, let me. I'm gonna just, you just hang off me, bro. Oh, what a cool Oh, oh, you're, what, you're, are you too low? No, oh, this looks so scary. Remember, he, he can bob his head. Whoa! The big shots. Nice, dude. Whoa. Dude, what, let's get down there. Okay, um, just pop out. off. You, you're on your grapple, remember? Oh yeah, that's right. That's right. I'll just do this. Big blue kibble. Man, that was uh. Oh no, I need more kibble. That was pro. Um. Oh no, I don't. Nice. Dude, look at that thing go. Oh, now I just need a Carno saddle. Well, I guess what? You can teleport back to the base and then last remote location back oh, here. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? I'm on it. I'm All gonna right, get a froggy. Right now, and I'll be right back. Excellent. Froggy, you are looking good. Right? This thing is cool. Look, hey, look it's green. I it's love green. the colors. It is so pretty it's, looking. I know, man. It's green. It's crazy. Oh, I'm going to eat this thing. So I found you could actually shoot off this Carno, dude, and it also is a charge. Really? Yeah, like if you charge up while you're running and then right click, like do the headbutt. It does uh, crazy extra damage. That's really strong, man. I've I've been leveling mine up for a bit. It started off like at like 500. Oh, I see the charging meter on it. Uh huh. Dude, what do the little fists mean on them? Little fists. Yeah, is that mate boost or something? I see in your guy. Oh. Here, look at my guy. Do I have a fist on him? Can you look uh, at me? No. There's like a black fist. I don't see that. Uh, over your guy. I don't know what the crap that means. It means something. Yeah, I don't see a black fist over yours. Huh, maybe you got like the special one. Oh, I got an awesome one. Oh, there we go. Oh. Get up! Like, I'm wondering if that's his version of mate boost. Let's see, is mine a male or female? Mine's There's a male. A male. Yours is a yeah. female. Yeah, but why? I but don't, there's I no don't heart know. for Mapu, so maybe that's like the thing for. Oh, I see the fist on mine too. You do? Yeah, it's like it's like you know, like where the little heart would be right above the name. It's black though, so oh. it's kind of hard to see. My guy's like dark colored. Oh, it, I do see it. All right, now I'm looking for it. I can see it. Huh? You put your froggy spectacles on so you can see. Yeah, yeah, I can <laughs> see it now. Oh, this is awesome. Dude, Apex Turtle! Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get him, Froggy. I didn't kill him. Nice. Isn't this fun? 
Hey, so dude, those things are really powerful. So did we beat Docs now? No, no. No, almost there. We're like halfway. So we're not even halfway. <laughs> we're not even. We're not even a tenth or a, a smidgen there. We literally have like uh, just the dinos that uh, um, just run around the map. Mm -hmm. so the ones we need are the Defeated ones that you can get Defeated, Docs! Oh. By well, right. well, one no, one hundredth of a percent. Yeah, yeah. headbutt. Yeah. I like this. Dude, these things are cool, man. Yeah, no, I like them a lot. Man, just being able to shoot off of them. That alone, like, sold me. Yeah, I think I think shooting off of them is pretty awesome. I, I like how beefy they are. Mm-hmm. Which is uh, blowing my mind right now. Yeah, no, they're made This charge meter thing is awesome. It, it adds... Like, that's how Cardos should be. Yeah, I just remember... I don't remember these things being so so beefy. Yeah, no, they're pretty good. I've only boosted uh, melee so far. So, I'm not oh, sure yeah. what else. It seemed like most other stats were kind of a waste. Yeah. I mean, well, I'm trying to get some health in there, but it doesn't do much. Yeah, so that's so, why I didn't even bother. To me, I worry about I mean, my, my melee first, because then I can harvest yeah. more. I mean, in all fairness, they're like glass cannons, and I'm cool with that. I'm well, cool I don't know. It's got more health than anything else I own, so. But yeah, yeah. I hear you. I uh, hear you. Oh, dude. I'm just so scared, because for some reason, we've been really lucky. I don't want to jinx us or nothing, but we've been really lucky, because... It's only a matter of time before we see, like, King Kong charging at us. Aw, oh, well, we'll see it when it happens. I'm not too oh. worried yet, Froggy. Yeah, I've had actually a nice day. I was It was like a, a stroll around docks. I was just, like, looking at the scenery and just, and just having a little fun in my spider. That's cool. Nice. I think what was happening was um, maybe maybe I just, I'm just too hardcore and I'm scaring away everything. I think that's it, Froggy makes sense to me i think maybe they're just waiting for you to get fattened up before they come and oh, eat you <laughs> yeah that could that i don't want that that is a scary thing i don't want him to come eat me oh uh, like well get some levels into that guy because right. i gotta find something to tame too all right sounds good dude froggy you got a rock trick chasing you I know I do, man. I know it's Omega Rock Drake. I don't even know what that is. I've never, oh, oh there did is. you see there a nest? Uh, yeah, it's on the beach. Oh, on the beach? Oh, yeah. I see it. I see it. Oh, there's oh, a rock drake. We might be able to get an egg. Oh, dude. Oh, oh I man. I gotta hurry. I gotta hurry. There's some bad stuff right here. Oh, hurry up. Hurry oh, up. I got oh, it. I got it, Froggy. Oh, run. Run. The Mega Rock Drake's coming. Oh, my grab. Don't get me. Don't get me. Don't get me. I got your egg sucker! Oh, you better hope that isn't one of those things that aggro's all the way back to our base. You could have told me this before I go and get the egg. Yeah, well, I know Megas, <laughs> man, they're, they're determined. They will chase you home hours later. They sh Oh, wait. Oh, God. Dude, he is following me. Oh, he's mad. No, he's following me. He just wants to kill somebody. He doesn't even care. <laughs> Wow, that thing's angry. <laughs> Should we teleport back to the base? Yeah, that might be a good idea. Oh so my lord. Yeah, I'll meet you there, Froggy. Dude, Froggy, we did it. Yeah, we did, man. I didn't think you were going to get that egg. Oh, Dude, it's... let's look at it. Oh, man. There wow, we go. Wow, it is beautiful, Froggy. Omega Rock Drake. Omega Rock Drake. Is. See, last time I played, it was on the center. There weren't any Rock Drakes, so I don't know what that is. Oh, that is so epic. All right, well, we'll have to find out if it's something we can hatch or, or what. I have no idea. I don't see why you couldn't. I bet you can. Man, that would be sweet. Yeah, I got to get power, though, so we can make uh, air conditioners and whatnot. I'll just leave it in here for now. Oh, that's a good idea. In the Foggy idea. Mac Kibble Station. Yeah, man, that's a good, good idea. Well, I think we did pretty good. You got your Carno. I did. We got an egg that we can hatch. I don't know. Maybe the next episode. Who knows? Oh, man. I want to see what it does. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll make sure that you're there when I hatch it. Oh, sounds good, man. I'm excited for that one. That's a good one. Oh, man. High five. I, oh, man. I think that was a high face. Oh, sorry about that. All right, okay. Froggy. Well, I'll see you tomorrow. Or actually, day after tomorrow. Your one yeah, day, day off is tomorrow. tomorrow. Yep, yep.
That's true. It's true. It's tomorrow. So I'll see you the day after tomorrow. All right, Foggy. See you then. All right, guys, I think today was a pretty successful day. We didn't have any major deaths, which is epic. It actually means you guys get to get your names that you chose from last episode. So, uh, yeah, I just went through the comments and now it is that time. That's right. Time to name the dinos. For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go through the comments of the previous episode and I pick out all the most awesome name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there. That's right. Just remember, if you want to have a chance at getting your name chosen, you got to be a subscriber. So smash that subscribe button and you got to comment down below. It is just that easy. Anyway, for today, uh, our Pteranodon, our super high level Pteranodon, will be known as none other than Twister. Had to do it because our original, what would have been Twister, yeah, was dead before we could name it. So, yep, you actually get the name, bro. Very cool. And for our Carno, it will be known as not Red Bull, but Blue Bull. I love it. You know, because he's blue. That is perfect. For next episode, oh my goodness, can't name the wyvern egg, but, or wyvern, uh, rock drake egg. But remember, we got trikes and we got the beaver. That's right. So we can name those guys for sure. So make sure to leave trike and beaver names down below. Anyway, guys, it has been awesome. Thank you oh so very much for hanging out with me on my adventures. As you always do, please remember... Show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe for the daily arc awesomeness. And as always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again and peace out.